Hi, Jason here. In this video, I want to show you exactly how you can use one of ChatGPT's latest updates, which is the ability to enter way more content, four times more content into that prompt. And that's because they have increased the amount of tokens available from 4,000 to 16,000. And to give you an idea, one token is worth four words. So um, I have a quick little Google search here and we can see that 64,000 characters in English is about between 9,142 words and 16,000 words. And that's if their space is counted as characters. So that's quite a big upgrade. And if you have used ChatGPT and you put in your prompt in the bottom here or some documentation or something that you want it to look through and you get this annoying message at the bottom here, the message you submitted was too long. Please reload the conversation and submit something shorter. It is really annoying. So the upgrade that allows you to enter way more content Content is actually not inside ChatGPT itself. The place to access it is in the playground. Now, if you have an OpenAI account, then you will have access to be able to jump into the playground. So log into your OpenAI account and then just click uh, playground at the top and then you'll end up here. And what we're looking for is actually this on the right hand side. It is the GPT 3.5 Turbo 16K. 16k being for 16,000 characters and now over the left hand side here if you've got it in the mode of chat which is basically just exactly the same kind of thing as chat gpt but in this user platform here we can go and put in like a massive chunk now i went and got this state of ai report uh 2022 and then copied a ton of it let me get it up here it's pretty big look here we go all this content here I'm just gonna go and select it all and then go and grab it. So if we just copy it like that and then uh, shoot over to uh, the playground, we're gonna paste it all in on this left-hand side. And you can see there's an absolute ton of text gone in there. And now we're able to, to use it just as we normally would with any prompt. So I can just say here, for example, what are 10 of the most interesting points in this report? And then we'll just, we have to press the submit button down the bottom there. But because it's able to cope with this vast amount of information, here it goes. So let's have a little look at what it's found out from this AI report. Uh, DeepMind made significant breakthroughs in the physical, or the, uh, physical sciences, including AI to solve a 40-year-old conjecture in representation theory. That sounds interesting. Um, another thing about DeepMind, OpenAI's language model Codex and Salesforce's conversational code gen impressed the computer science community with their ability to complete code and provide coding requirements in natural language. So lots of useful things there. It's able to just go through here. Oh, or even one there. Look, OpenAI trained a model to play Minecraft. Well, that's pretty interesting. Uh, I noticed that it, it kind of stopped after eight there. So we could just say the usual thing, which is just continue. And then it should hopefully just carry on. There we go. Number nine, plastic recycling received a boost with ML engineered enzymes capable of degrading PET, uh, a major contributor to global solid waste. So this extra ability is going to be absolutely brilliant. It's not available in uh, GPT-4 yet. Now, you may have it just in here. And in fact, if we just go and refresh this page just to kind of prove a point and we'll go and paste in that big old bit of text there again and click submit, uh, I would now expect. Oh, no, it's actually managed to do it. So there may not be quite enough uh, text there to bamboozle GPT-4, which still in theory should be on the uh, same amount of characters as it always was. But this is really really useful but how to get to it as i say you need to just go to the open ai account click on playground and then choose that sixteen thousand window which will just give you so much more um, to play with when you're doing your prompts um, other useful things that you can do with it for example if you've got like if you're into youtube or you want to go and grab the information from a youtube video 
Uh, if we look at some of mine, if I pick one that's actually quite long, so that means I'm I'm rabbiting on for quite a bit. There you go. There's a 24 minute um, video. That that was a long one, wasn't it? And I'll just pause it. And what I'll do is I'll go here and grab that transcript, which should be pretty big. We'll toggle the timestamps to get rid of that. And then I can literally just drag my mouse down and we can just grab that entire transcript now and then dump it straight into here again. We'll refresh this and go back to the uh, 3.5 16K turbo, paste it all in, and then we can ask a question um, and just say something like, give me five interesting bullet points from this transcript. And off we go. So hopefully it should be able to read through that without any issues. There we go. Bard, Google, Google's AI is still in the experimental phase, but holds potential uh, to revolutionize the education system. There we go. As is ChatGPT. And by the way, if you're into ChatGPT and you're, you love all this stuff, you need to come and join my free group. Oh, we've got seven people waiting to jump in as we speak. It's coming up to uh, 6,000 members now. And we're all basically chat GPT, large language model mad. There's people sharing great uh, prompts, uh, all the latest software extensions for chat GPT. This is going to be just really good for you. There's some, uh, well, there's, there's so many people in here now from all over the world. And we're all just uh, mad about AI. So if that's you, the link is underneath this video. It's free. As I say, just come and join. Um, but there we are. So we're able to use this playground to effectively get a ton of more text into this and then be able to work with it and do all of the normal stuff that we could with ChatGPT, um, but in a different place. That's all. So I hope you found this useful and uh, make sure you do use that extra 16,000 uh, tokens that we have access to now. And then I'll see you in another video in just a second. So wait there and you'll see it recommended. All right. Thanks for watching.